All right, hello everybody. How are y'all doing? Hopefully y'all doing good. Hello. <laughs> so today we're gonna be doing a little bit of video on my setup and everything. What do? How do I get my model in? What are all of this? What's all of this? And a little bit of simple setup. <laughs> so, uh, to do what I'm doing, I have my what is it? Lopet. That is what I use. Now, to get this thing on to my screen, all I do is, um, I'm just gonna go to my main gaming uh, thing. And I'm gonna pop up. So, I'm gonna delete my cam. I'm gonna redo it for you guys. So, uh, add source, add new. And we're going to be doing game capture. <clears throat> be calm test. I'm just going to name it that. So we got our new VCAM. <clears throat> now, uh, when you get it up, you're probably just going to scale it down somewhere. And scale it as much as you want, move it where you want. So let's say this, for example. Uh, and then we're gonna be doing is filter. Where is filter? <laughs> am I blind? Yes, I am blind. <laughs> um, go down, color key. And now we're gonna have uh, our green cutout. Now there's gonna be this green stuff here on the ear and edges. Just pull this up a little bit. And you should see that the green is pretty much gone. And that's good. Of course, you don't want too much. <laughs> Oof. Um, yeah. I'm almost like a ghost. <laughs> uh, so yeah. Just play with it until you're satisfied. Click done. This is good. No more green. Mm -hmm. Okay, so... Now, what we're going to be doing is um, <coughs> uh, looking all, all of the rest of the things now. <laughs> uh, for all of you guys that are starting off with streaming, uh, this is how you set up your avatar, which is the main thing uh, for us. Now, you want your <coughs> alert box. Alert box will be the very top of your sources. This basically your layers if you're working on photoshop or you're working in any other art program you got layers it's like things are for a normal person maybe uh books stacked up on each other and you see the first book only <coughs> well uh, uh only uh smaller books you can still see of course the bigger books behind them like you you get it basically this is stuck up on top of all of this, and this is the thing that's the, the bottom of it. So if something is over this, like <clears throat> me, complete, if I completely cover it, I of course cover it completely. Uh, what's under it? Well, you get it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Too much explaining. Um, yeah. So, alert box. We're gonna do properties. After you click the plus icon, obviously, and add to alert box, everything here is added with the plus. <clears throat> Properties, you go to, let's say, followers, for example, that's going to be your first thing you probably want to set up. Go to animation or media, I mean, change. So all of this is just like <clears throat> stuff I dragged in. You just click and drag, you click whatever you want. And then it's going to be your animation, which is your video file. A sound file, if you don't have a sound in your video, you can use a sound file. So that's that. It's pretty much the same for everything else. You can test your... Um, for <clears throat> whatever you want. Let's say the follow animation, which is uh, that. Over here, 
Uh, yeah. Alright, my overlays. Now, to catch all of these crawly things and... Uh, the overlay. Overlay is just a simple PNG image. That's all it is. This overlay. And what the scrolling thing on top is a stream. It's a stream label. It's like the very last thing on stream of OBS. <clears throat> so, uh, now, mm -hmm. we're gonna want to, <clears throat> uh, we can put a filter on them as well, a scroll filter. If you just click on that and click a scroll filter, and then you will get a scroll filter if you want a scrolling effect, for example. <clears throat> now... Um, <clears throat> you can also click properties, which is, uh, you put the label type, most recent donator for me for this one, as well be my recent sub, and then my recent follower. <laughs> so you can just do that for your label type, and then it should, uh, get your template. Mm -hmm. like so and then you can do your color you can do everything else quite simple straightforward font size size for text <clears throat> okay also put a folder which you can click add like folder so it's easy for me so i can click an eyeball and everything in the folder just hides itself so if there's a game that I'm playing and uh, all the information on the game is below. I can just hide it or something or maybe use a different overlay instead. It's easier that way instead of uh, turning each thing off. <clears throat> so, uh, display capture which captures the whole display. My other game capture which captures my gameplay obviously. Uh, League of Legends window, which is going to be my window capture. If anybody plays League of Legends, this is going to be my... Where I click the play button and everything else for Q and stuff. And then a simple image for the background, if you guys want, instead of a black void. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, just click and drag, basically, uh, an image into here. Simple. Starting soon screen. Uh, very simple, straightforward. So, uh, music or uh, MP4, which is the video of this. PNG, which is just starting soon, as you see. Uh, music, no, co no copyright preferred. You guys can play, but of course, you uh, bots are going to be half muted, so it's not good and also it's just it's just safer to keep on the royalty free you know copyright music <clears throat> um mm -hmm. uh, sub donor follower same thing and alert box <clears throat> my vr my uh, vr i use suba a different picture here i well there was sound soundboard as well which is just a web file or web uh, browser source I mean or web file <clears throat> and just the link to my soundboard thing which I use panel for that's just a different video entirely <clears throat> YouTube which is what you guys normally see me or normally what I would use is YouTube right now I'm just using uh, <clears throat> OBS Studios to record this, my Streamlabs OBS, but normally I would just use Streamlabs for everything. It works for me just fine. <clears throat> so I got um, all of these things. So my display capture, if I need to use display capture, uh, game capture, if I need to record a window as well. Window capture, if game capture doesn't work normally. 
and keyboard, which is my keyboard that I normally use on my Blender videos and Unity videos for all of you guys to see what buttons I'm pressing, which is basically just a program that I use. And then, uh, well, top things, which isn't really for content purposes, it's mostly, well, people. Um, my top, not my top bit person, my top uh, donator, and then my top gift subber is all here. <clears throat> and just my recent subscribers, which I would use then to open up my Discord and just update people who subscribe to me and everything else. Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah. Uh, I'm just going to my ga main gaming. Oh, good. <clears throat> also, if you made a mistake, like, oh, let's say I made this too big, I can press Ctrl Z and I can go back. Mm -hmm. Alright, so, <clears throat> hopefully you guys found this helpful and any questions down below, don't be shy. And also, my Discord is down below. Don't forget, you can also ask me there as well. So, um, also, I want to take my pension or my Patreon. I have only one Patreon now, but it's okay. I'll support it anyway. Welcome. All the likes and mm, all your support is all, all I need, really. <laughs> so, thank you all, and every little helps anyway. Thank you all for support. Hopefully, I'll see you guys on my stream next, which will be uh, tomorrow. Uh, yeah, so goodbye everybody and see you on the next video. Hopefully, you guys uh, like it and yeah, comment down below for any other videos. So yeah, goodbye everybody. This was me the video because you guys asked for it. So much love. Thank you all. Bye bye. Yeah. <laughs>